Hi everyone! Today I'm going to present the different essentials in the service area which are the silverware. First is dinner fork. Dinner fork with four times essentials to the formal dinner used to the most of the meals or roast. Second is pastry fork. Pastry is six inches, three prong with sharp edges used to the pastries and cold nets. And the third one is the curving fork. Curving fork used for large rust, home steaks, and other nets. Next is a large serving fork. Large serving fork used to the serving nets or dish like pan set and other oriental noodles. Next is fish fork. Fish fork is used with a fish course in a serve. It is typically smaller than the meat fork and it is prepared with a knife and as is to either manipulating the fish in the plate. Uh, next is snail fork. Snail fork is 5 inches to prong fork used to draw out snails from shells. Next is oyster fork. Oyster fork it is usually 6 inches, 3 prong used to the picking oyster from shell. And the next one is soup spoon. Soup spoon is this rounded bowl used for soft dishes. Next is dinner spoon. Dinner spoon mostly same size or height of that a dinner fork and may be used together with it. Next is teaspoon. Teaspoon used for coffee and tea and some desserts like that. And Next is Demeta spoon. Demeta spoon is smaller than a teaspoon used for after dinner coffee, condiments, or caviar. Next is Maro spoon. Maro spoon is a specially designed spoon which is engineered to help consumers get Maro out of homes. Next is Perfait spoon. For face spoon, it is usually 8 inches long handle teaspoon of ice cream and shake served in tall glasses. Next is dinner knife. Dinner knife essentials to the formal dinner use for all meals or roast. Next is steak knife. Steak knife, it is usually 7 inches sharp edge knife to carve steaks allowing to the juice to flow out slowly. Next is fish knife. Fish knife used when a fish course is served. It is a part of fish fork to assist in cutting the fish. Next is buttered knife. Butter knife may refer to other any table knife designed with a dull edge and rounded point. Next is mustard butter knife. Mustard butter knife, it is a sharp pointed dull edge knife often with a silvery shape used only to serve outputs of butter from a central butter dish to individual dinner's plate. Next is cheese knife. Cheese knife is specialized for the cutting of cheese. Next is bar knife. Bar knife is sliced and serves lemon limes also used as a bottle opener. Next is carving knife. Carving knife used for large roast, ham, steaks, and other meats. Next is oyster knife. Oyster knife can do the task of splitting a broth first and proceeding to properly process the most tender meats hidden within. Next is cake knife. Cake knife used for slicing cakes. Choose well. Next is ice tongs. Ice tongs used to pick smaller pieces of ice with their cubes or two. Next is uh, lobster crackers. Lobster crackers these are used to crack and open shells of lobster and crabs when they are cooked and served with the shell. Next is snail tongs. Snail tongs it is usually six inches used to hold up snail shell to draw out the snail with a fork. Next is gravy ladle. Gravy ladle used for the sauces gravy and dressings. Next is 
soup ladle. Soup ladle used to serve soup. And next is pasta pong. Pasta pong used to serve pasta or may also be used for chopped green salad. Next is met pong. Met pong is intended for the meat items and can be also used for pastry items. And the next is pizza slicer. Pizza slicer sharp edge will type knife used to, for cutting pizza. Next is ice oh, kitchen tong. Kitchen tong big tong used for frying. Next is ice bucket. Ice bucket used as container for ice being served at the table. Next is water pitcher. Water pitcher used as container water, the other beverages like juice, soda, ice, etc. And lastly, it is a food cover, like used covering food, especially during room service. Thank you.